Hey everyone, I'm Laurentio and welcome to part 3 of Mario games I found for Java. Super Mario Sea and Adventure is this Mario on drugs game. Just like Super Saiyans, Mario is fast, but since the player, you, are not a Super Saiyan, you can't follow the speed of the game. And since the controls aren't perfect, and in a fast game you really need some perfect controls, the game can get brutally hard later on. Mario Bros Super Worm is that awesome Mario experience I was talking about throughout this whole series, but this time the Mario character model was replaced by Worm from Worms. The game still remains great. Mario Kart for Java is pretty weird, but also unique. Doesn't try to imitate the usual kart game for Java, which ironically rips off Mario Kart anyway, but tries to be unique, and it succeeds. Sure, the game doesn't have replay value, but for novelty reasons, the game is unique and you should try it. You have to dodge obstacles on the track, that's basically the game, forget about power ups, power slides or competition, the, the road is your enemy in this game. Super Angry Mario tries to imitate Angry Birds, but fails, due to lack of animations and creative level designs. The game feels very shallow. Mario Kart is another very unique Mario game for Java. I have never seen a Java game like this. It seems like the fans have the same innovative spirit just like Nintendo, trying out new things. With more stuff to do in the game, it could have been a hit, but like this, it's nice for novelty reasons, but the game doesn't hook you. After a few minutes, you're already bored of the game. Super Mario Dream Blur is pretty good. It's the classic Mario experience with psychedelic events added to the mix. It's a pretty good game. Mario Kart Super Extreme is the classic kart game you usually get on Java. The game seems to be a reskin of Rayman Kart for Java. In this game you get 6 playable characters, 7 worlds, aka 7 race tracks, and different race modes like lap circuit, time attack, or collect more coins than the other opponent. Also you can upgrade the vehicles. Like, for example, each one has a dual exhaust version of the car and more upgrades. And there are multiple difficulties you can choose from. It's a nice game. And Super Mario Puzzle is exactly what it looks like. And depending on the version you get, there can be more pictures or just this one. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, click the join button and choose one of the perks. You have the link to the join button in the description. Also, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord if you want. And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.